Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday, Microsoft has announced that support for the use of pass keys is now available to all Microsoft consumer accounts, which means you can now sign into your Microsoft account using biometric methods like your face or fingerprint or a device pin. Now, just a brief overview quickly as to how pass keys um, actually work and what they're all about in case you're unaware. Now, according to Microsoft, pass keys work differently than passwords. So instead of a single, what they're calling vulnerable secret password, pass key access uses two unique keys known as a cryptographic key pair. So one key is stored, they say, safely on your device, guarded by your biometrics or PIN, and the other key stays with the app or website for which you create the pass key. So you need both parts of the key pair to sign in. Read the fact it's called a pass key. Now, Practically, and if we have a look at this uh, image provided from that announcement, um, how does signing into your Microsoft account using a pass key work? So basically, when you get to the sign-in prompt, as we can see here to the uh, left-hand side, and when you sign into your Microsoft account, you can use your pass key by choosing sign-in options. And here's my sign-in options um, in real time um, when I was signing into my Microsoft account. So at the top here, You've your sign in options, and then you can select face, fingerprint, pin, or a security key. So basically, you use your device to sign in with a pass key. Then you can use an app, or you can get a code emailed to you. So, and then you can show more options. And then, once that's done, obviously, your device will open a security window, and then you can use your pass key to sign in. So, that's more or less just in a brief um, nutshell how this whole process will work. And according to this announcement, um, you can use pass keys to sign into your Microsoft account, including um, services like Microsoft 365 and Copilot on desktop and mobile browsers. And at this stage, though, um, Microsoft has announced that the pass key signing support for Microsoft's mobile apps will be added uh, in the coming weeks. So pass key support for mobile apps is not available as yet. So if you are waiting for that, then I'm sure it'll be getting to us over the next couple of weeks. And if you would like some more info regarding the introduction of pass keys for consumer accounts, um, I will leave this uh, support post, this blog post, um, down below in the description if you would like more info because this will give you a lot more information if this would be something of interest to you. And although... Um, pass keys are becoming um, more the norm now. I personally don't think passwords will be going anywhere uh, too soon. And I uh, um, just wanted to put this out there if this would be something that would interest you. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.